I'm Christelle from Diabetes Strong. In this video, I'll be showing you how to get started with the Freestyle Libre 3 CGM. So that includes how to insert the sensor, but also how to get you started with the Freestyle Libre 3 app. Before you get started, make sure that you have at least one Freestyle Libre 3 sensor, alcohol swaps, or something similar to clean your skin with, and that your smartphone is compatible with the Freestyle Libre 3 sensor. You can see all the compatible smart devices out here. So look through the list and just make sure that your device is compatible. Let's start with setting up the Freestyle Libre 3 app because we actually can't even start the sensor before we have the app up and running. If you don't have the app, you want to download that first. But what you do is you simply click start it and then next you'll see I'll click next on all of them. So I already have an account. So we're going to log in with that. If you don't and create an account, click next. And then remember to read through everything. If you accept it, click accept. If you do not, then you say decline. For example, they say, do you want to be part of their study? You choose it, yes or no. There is no obligation here. If you want to hear from them, you say, yes, I agree to this. If you do not, you say no. So just read through all of it in your own time. Click next. Once you're ready to move forward here, we say it's the US. Then you have to decide, is it grams or is it servings? For me, it's grams. And we're basically ready to get started. Just click this big button and it just now it explains to you what you'll see on the screen. Read the things. If you've never used Libre, it, these are good things to know. So simply read through it once you're done. Click next. Here we go. Again, showing how to do a finger stick. You probably know that. Let's click next. How the graphs works, how the alarms. So you do have to set up so the alarms will sound. So you say allow here, and that simply allows for the alarms to sound. But now we're ready. Let's get that sensor on. Now that we have the app up and running, let's apply the sensor. First thing you want to do is clean your skin with water and soap and let it dry. Once you've done that, you can wipe down your skin with the alcohol swab. Okay, let's get that Libre 3 on there. My skin is clean, but I also want to use an alcohol swap. That is also recommended just to make sure that it's completely clean. So it's approved for the back of the arm. So that's where we're putting it. There we go. And you want to let that air dry. So Libre 3 comes like this. It's already assembled, so to say. So the sensor's in here. I'm just gonna come a little closer. Let's just Take it apart so you see there's a little bit of tape. You're just supposed to twist it. There we go. See? Okay, twisting. Here, see that needle? It's in there. So this we don't need anymore. And hold it up. I'm gonna place it here. So <laughs> just push in. And there you go. There she is, tiny. Just smoothing out the tape. Let's get it set up in the, let's get it set up in the app. Let's open up the Libre app again. Here you just want to click next. And then in the middle of the screen, it says scan my sensor. You want to click that and it's going to prompt you. Here we go. Hold your phone up against the sensor. Once it's registered, give this check mark. And then there's another alert just reminding you don't take high amounts of C vitamin. And now the 60 minute warm up period has started. So it means no readings for 60 minutes. But once the warm up period's over, here we go, you'll start to get readings in the app. So see, initial blood sugar was 74. I also did a finger stick, it said 88. That's within what's considered accurate. So good enough and ready to go. When you warn it for at least 12 hours, this is what you'll see in the app. You'll see your actual blood sugar as well as a 12 our overview. When the two weeks are over, you simply peel off the sensor and apply a new one. Remember to rotate where you place the sensor. I think rotating between arms makes a lot of sense. It's been two weeks. It's time to take off that sensor. So let me get close. You can see it's peeling a little bit, but it's not too bad. So you just pull it. So that's sticking. Here we go. I need to clean that up, but it's the sensor. And that is how you get started with the Freestyle Libre 3. 
I hope you found this helpful. If you did, please give this video a like below and leave me a comment. Also, if you enjoy my content, if you find it helpful, remember to subscribe to my channel and turn on notifications. That is that little bell. That way you'll be informed whenever I post new content. Thank you so much for watching.